Well, the lack of low-income housing is a growing concern for many residences as Northern Nevada continues to grow. But oftentimes, the more vulnerable groups, like seniors, are left without many options. Kai Sisson shows us how seniors are feeling the effects of the region-wide shortage of affordable housing. Here at the recently opened Lincoln Way Senior Apartments in Sparks, residents who were able to get a room are considered the lucky ones. For seniors, they really don't have any other options. When it comes to housing, many seniors are filling the pinch. Fixed incomes and high health care and medication costs make housing something many have to go without. According to the Department of Housing and Urban Development, there were more than 300,000 homeless Americans 50 years of age or more. That number is 20% higher than in 2007. Working with homeless seniors is common for officials. I had a woman in just a couple weeks ago. She had just moved into a unit and, you know, she was so happy because she was she was senior. The Reno Housing Authority issues housing vouchers for people in need. They can be used at Section 8 facilities, public housing or with private property owners. But as rent prices continue to rise, many landlords are not accepting those vouchers. We're seeing landlords not wanting to accept the program because they can get higher rents than what our families can afford. The wait lists at affordable housing complexes are extremely long. And for Lincoln Way, advertising the property wasn't even necessary. Just word of mouth that a new project is coming online and more than enough need to immediately fill the building. According to Hobson, there is a goal of a thousand additional units set aside just for low income seniors. And the need is especially urgent. So this project being 45, you know, it, it is making a difference, but it's really just scratching the surface of the need in the community. Covering the story, Kai Sisson, Channel 2 News. And we have a link on where seniors can find resources about housing. Just head to our website, ktvn.com, and click on the blue News Links button.